The cut tool in Prusa Slicer is a very useful feature when you need to divide a model into smaller parts. You might want to cut a model into multiple pieces before printing if the model is too big to be printed in one piece, if you only want to print part of a model, if part of a model needs to be printed in a different orientation for added strength, or if printing the model in one piece would require a large amount of support material. Click on the Cut Tool button. A new window will pop up. Here you can see a preview of your model on a slider. You can move this slider up and down to adjust the cut position. As you move the slider, you'll see a plane cutting through the model in the preview. This plane represents where your model will be cut. The new Cut Tool allows you to cut models at any angle and generate connectors which allow you to reassemble after printing. You can also hold down the shift key and click on two points of the object to quickly define a cutting plane. In the cut window there are different options you can explore including the orientation of each cut piece. You can also reset the cut selection and you can add connectors so that your pieces can be reassembled after printing. So click on add connectors and you'll have two connector options plug connectors or dial connectors. You can also choose the shape, depth, size and tolerance of the connector. The tolerance setting defaults to 0.1 millimeters, which should work well for most printers. The plug type will add extra geometry to one side of the cut and subtract it from the other side. Once selected, click to choose a placement of each plug. Click confirm connectors and click perform cut to see the results. The dowel type will subtract the pin from both sides of the object and generate extra objects to print as the connectors. Click to choose placement of each connector. Click confirm connectors and click perform cut to see the results. You can see that the dowels will print separately to the object. Click on slice now at the bottom right to see how your model will look when printed. As always, use the slider to check the first layer of your print to ensure that there's good adhesion with the print bed. So that's the cut too. Happy printing.